This guide will demonstrate the implementation and notable features of the License Spring end user portal. Software vendors often need to handle large volumes of license related customer support requests, such as resetting or transferring licenses to a new device or assigning and reassigning end user licenses. License Spring provides an end user portal so that both of these tasks can be done as a self serve process thereby reducing customer support overhead for the software vendor. Let's take a look. The default URL for the end user portal can be found at users.licensespring.com. A vendor can modify the look and feel of their end user portal by changing the colors and adding their logo. These controls can be found in the License Spring platform by navigating to Account Settings User Portal Configuration. The URL to the end user portal can also be white labeled, allowing the vendor to host it on their own subdomain. Please contact License Spring customer support in order to white label the end user portal. There are two types of roles that the end user can be. The license user is a role defined at the license level for user based licenses. Every license can have one or more users assigned to it, and when logging into the end user portal, a license user can reset their password along with any devices that they have activated their license on. The license manager is a role defined at the order level. A license manager can reset individual licenses, which applies to both key-based and user-based licenses of a given order. Additionally, for user-based licenses, the license manager can assign or unassign users to a particular license. Both license users and managers access the portal through the same login screen. They will require the company code, their email address, and password in order to access their account. For user-based licenses, this is the same email password used to authorize the software application. When an end user is assigned to a license, License Spring can optionally send an email with login instructions as well as an initial password for them to access their account. In order to send these credentials to the end user via email, please navigate to Account Settings Settings and tick the box Send Activation Emails for User-Based Licenses. A license manager can be added to an order at the moment the order is created, or at any time after. If issuing licenses manually through the platform, be sure to tick the box Customer is License Manager in the Order Creator. The customer will then receive login instructions to the portal in their email. In order to add a license manager to an order programmatically, please find technical documentation under the License Spring Management API. If you have any questions implementing the end user portal, please contact License Spring Customer Support.